So what I should do... I think I gave a berry to Wormple 6. Okay, great. <laughs> wow, that was a real, uh... That was a real help. You really pulled through for me there, Wormple 6. Good job! I'm gonna max revive. I'm gonna max revive Wormple 3. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Mr. Red Plays the Wormple Challenge. Now, you may be thinking to yourself, Hey, self, couldn't Mr. Red be more enthused about this episode? And you know what? Yeah, I could, except for one thing. I have been hard at work doing something with these Wurmple. By the way, Tentacool is out first and he has damage. That's because even though I used Super Repel, I still got into battles. I think it's because Tentacool is out first and he has such a high level that it doesn't... I mean, low level compared to the Wurmples that... I, I don't know how Super Repel works. I think it just takes your first Pokemon and judges if a Pokemon is stronger or weaker than it or something like that. And since Tentacool was out first by accident, that was it. So anyway... Tentacool is not the issue here. We can actually just go ahead and switch Tentacool with Wormple 3 because I think we want Wormple 3 out first, and here's why. Let's go to Wormple 3 now and go to Summary. I'm going to go over to their attacks, their moves, and you'll see something that took me a while. This is it. They all, ha all of my Wormples have zero moves. I went through down to like the low, the first, the beginning route where he first caught all these Wurmple. Let's see, route, where was it? Let's let's move over. Where did it found? Met at level two, route 101. I went to route 101 and I just fought a bunch of Pokemon and I got rid of them and then I healed them so they were at full health. And this took so long. This took so long. So this was a suggestion by Beast Mode on Z to use none of my moves that I could use, but instead struggle because it does different types of damage. It might be a stronger move. It's the secret fourth move that Wurmple can use. And so I'm doing this. What I should have done, and I only thought to do this after I had already done everything, was to keep one of them at full moves. That way that one could use Poison Sting and then I could send out the other ones to get damaged. That would have been a good idea, but I could always use one of my items. I have many. Do I want to do this, actually? I could use like a P, no, not a PP, uh, but like a Max Ether. It fully restores the PP of a selected move. I think I'm gonna do this for one of the Wurmple, and I think I'm gonna do it to the Wurmple that will survive the longest, Wurmple 5 because I want one of the Wurmple to be able to use Poison Sting, or do I want to use this on Wurmple 2, who goes first? Usually. Oh god, it's such an awful, awful thing. Why am I doing the Wurmple challenge? This is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. Let's do it on Wurmple 5. Wurmple 5 will last longer. On Poison Sting. You don't have any idea how hard it was to get rid of all of these moves? I had to use Poison Sting, and it did one-shots, and Tackle did one-shots, but String Shot doesn't do damage, which means I had to use a String Shot. There's 40 of them, I think. I think there's 40 of them. Anyway. Oh, God. Okay, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Okay, PP was restored. One plus five Poison Sting. But seriously, I had to, like, use all of the... Po uh, uh, whatever, string shots, so it took so long to do that. It took so long to do that. And then I went and I sold everything that I had uh, that I didn't use. I, I think I might have had a couple of items that I ended up selling. I sold every single one of my uh, moves that weren't HMs because I can't use any of them for Wurmple and none of them are needed to progress through the game, so I'm never gonna use any of them. I sold them all, realized I could have done that from the beginning. Uh, but what I did was, this might have been stupid, I went to the gambling place and I sold everything that I had and then I bought as many tickets as I could. Did I do that or did I just buy a couple? Let's see how much money I have. I don't have, I probably don't have a lot of money. Uh, okay, I have some money. Anyway, I, I, sp I bought some coins, gold coins and everything. And then what I would do is I would set a limit for, I saved the game, I would set a limit for myself and I said if I go below this limit, I'm just gonna restart. And then I would keep like, eventually I would make more and more and more. And I was going to keep doing that, but I didn't. Instead, I didn't. 
I did other stuff. Okay, so I believe that I'm all set. I have Wormpool 5 who's ready. So I can't use Poison Sting on the first one, which is the Skarmory, hence the whole situation. So I'm not going to send out Wormpool 5 who has the Poison Stings yet. Wormpool 3 is going to go out first because at this point, well, maybe I do want the defense to go out first, which means I didn't want Wormpool 5 to get the thing. It's fine. No, Wormpool 3 will go out first. I don't know if... I don't know if attack is f factored into struggle. Hmm. I don't know. So I don't know if Wurmple 3 will be stronger or not. It took so long. I can't believe how long it took to just go through that. It was hours of my life, I feel like. Okay, Steven. Oh, wow, Link. Heard it all before. It's fine. How are you guys doing? How's it going? Oh, okay. So this is the first episode I'm recording since I did the, uh, the fundraiser thing that I did. And I don't know how that actually went, because this is Monday that I'm recording it. And I, I haven't yet. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, Wurmple 3 has no moves left. Wait, what happened? Wait a second. Wait, what happened? Am I going to do it? I'm poisoned. That's not good. Oh, does it always go second? Okay! Okay! And it didn't do that much damage to me. Uh-oh. Okay, this is the problem, though. This is the problem, though. Oh, okay. We're starting off with a critical hit. Why? Why? Answer me. Answer the question. Why would we do that? Do you know what I went through to make this happen? And you're going to start with a critical hit? It does seem that struggle always goes second, though, which I guess is a good thing, simply because... Simply because... I don't know what I was... I don't know what I was saying there. I just realized that I still have to do the thing where I... Tear, wear down his... His aerial ace, because I can't do anything when he's using it. I have to, I have to heal myself, the hyper potion, every time, because he uses a, an aerial ace, and it almost kills me. And if I, if I use struggle, he goes first, and will kill me. Okay, guys, I'm going to do that. I'm just going to use, I'm just going to use full restore and super potion and all that until he's done. <laughs> but wait, he stops. He is using other moves sometimes. So he waits, he waits. I don't know. It's, it's confusing. I don't know how I'm going to do this because my, my regular approach. So it seems to be doing the same amount that Wurmple 3 is, which means I don't think the attack really does much in the way, oh geez, much in the way of anything. But, 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 okay, so my problem is, my struggle is that when I, that's probably not a good thing to say, but uh, my th whole situation is when he's just using Aerial Ace and I'm just healing myself, what I can do is just stop the timer that I have going, lean back and just spam the button, you know? But if he's going to intersperse it with things that aren't that, like he used Toxic earlier, and that allowed me to actually do something, but now he's back to using Aerial Ace each time. So I'm like doing stuff, but the episode's going to be a million hours long if I sit here and have to do the whole thing without like stop. Okay, well, I don't know. I'll, I'll see what happens. Bye, everyone. Steel Wing, which he used a second ago, does that much damage to me. I was at full health, now I have that much damage. And that's weird, because... Why? Um, and, 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 like, do, does, do I... If he uses Aerial Ace... Oh, see, he used Toxic, because he wants to poison me. I'm onto your game. Well, I'm not. I don't understand it. So I'll definitely be able to hit him this one time. See? And then... Okay. Struggle does a lot more. That's good. Oh, whoops. Uh-oh. Well, Wurmple 4 is out. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking there. I wasn't. I just wasn't. That's okay, though. Uh, Wurmple 4 I don't super care about. Send out somebody else. Send out Wurmple 2. 
Level 2 does usually go first, so maybe... Maybe I'll be able to do something. I'll be able to hit him once. Every time I go out, unless I get critical hitted, I'll be able to do one damage. Until they all have to until I have to use revive on them all. Because when I use revive, they're at half health. That's not gonna work out. He's also gonna use his super potion, which is actually gonna happen a lot. Whoops! Uh-oh. Now he's gonna kill Ripple 2. Uh-oh, maybe this won't kill me. It will. It will. It absolutely will. I don't know why I'm so excited. Because it did. It did kill me. I'm killed. So now Ripple 6. This is almost it. This is almost it! I'm just gonna have to heal my other worms. But I can use... Uh, I can use something. I can use Struggle Now. And he's gonna Aerial Ace me. It won't kill me. Hopefully, unless he gets a critical hit. He didn't. Okay, so I will be able to hit him once. Now might be the time when he uses his uh, Super Potion. So what I should... I think I gave a berry to Wormple 6. Okay, great. <laughs> wow, that was a real, uh, that was a real help. He really pulled through for me there, Wormple 6. Good job! I'm gonna max revive. I'm gonna max revive Wormple 3. That's what I'm gonna do. Since, since attack doesn't matter, I definitely should have used Wormple 5 to go out first. Without, without healing. It's fine. You know what? It's fine. It's honestly, genuinely fine. I don't care. I'm zen. I'm so at peace. I couldn't be happier. Can't you tell? Okay, I'll be able to use struggle once unless he gets another critical hit, which we'll see. Okay, Whew, I was really worried. All right, now what I'm gonna do is just work on healing myself. He's gonna heal himself, so that's fine. Uh, actually, if he's definitely gonna heal himself this time, but I don't know that he will, but I'm pretty sure he will. I could get away with using one more struggle. Why is this so hard? Why is this such a difficult thing? It shouldn't be these tough choices. I should just be able to punch him and he dies. That's how Pokemon works. I don't know. All right, all right. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go for it. Okay, yes, he is doing this. All right, great. He's using a full restore, which means I can hit him with struggle, then I can heal myself. Everything's fine, Peter. All right, here we go, boom. Okay. I said with recall, but that's not too bad. All right, heal myself, heal myself. Let's see, I can use a hyper potion. This will heal me for 200 points, which is just barely over my whatever. I'm just kidding, yep, good, okay. Whew. All right, all right, all right. Hey, Steel Wing, that's good. That doesn't mean he's done with Aerial Ace, though. He's just stupid. I'm gonna hit him once. He's gonna use it, and it might kill me. It might, it just might. Oh, I'm still alive. I didn't mean to make that sound. That was weird, but listen. Listen, I need this right now, okay? Ah. Ah. Use a Hyper Potion. Uh, okay, so Wurmple 5 is the only other Wurmple alive, and I can't really use him until her until the other Pokemon come out. By the way, Beast Rodan Z also left a comment letting me know what the other Pokemon are that he has, and I'm gonna leave it a surprise. I'm gonna leave it a mystery for you guys. If you want to read the comment, you can go back. It's on part 275, but I'm not gonna say what it is. But it's the worst case scenario, so... I don't know, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't think it's gonna be possible to beat this guy. I genuinely don't. I do not believe that I can beat this guy. I think that it's not going to be possible. There is not a world, conceivable universe, in which Steven is beat by me doing the Marple Channel. No series of events could transpire that would allow me, Mr. Red, playing this game and a successful victory happens. There is not one of those. I can't do it. There isn't a way for me to do it. I would love nothing more than to do it, but I can't do it. It can't be done. Not by me, not by anyone. If I could do it, I would. I'd just sit here and do it. I would sit here and I'd be having a great time. I'd be like, look, I'm about to do it. And then I would do it and then I would walk away. It'd be over. I wouldn't have to think about it anymore. But no, that's not the case. The case is that I can't do it. 
I could sit here and I could stare at the screen all day and I could play the game and I could go all home and I can do other stuff. I can watch TV and I can play the game and get rid of all my stuff. I can train, I can get them all to level 100. They're all level 100. They're the max they could be. They cannot be stronger. All that I can do is strategy and none of the strategies are good enough to do it. If I could do it, I would. I can't express to you how much I want to do this. If there was a way that I could, if I could reach into the cosmos of the universe and alter the fabric of Pokemon itself and allow me to do this, I would do that. I would reach into that cosmos and I would look at it in its beating, gross, cosmic heart. And I would say, listen, Pokemon, I'm going to beat the Wurmple Challenge today. You're not gonna beat me, Wormble Challenge. I'm gonna beat you. And I'm gonna go home, and I'm gonna cry like a baby because I won. I destroyed Steven. But that's not the case. The case is that I'm not gonna be able to beat Steven because he's a machine. He's, a ro he's literally the robot of the game that knows every fiber of my brain wants to do this. It knows that. And that's why it's not gonna let... This is a curse. That's what this is. This is a Groundhog Day style curse imposed on me where I can't beat this game. So I'll see you in the next episode. Guys, thank you so much for watching. In two days, we're going to come back here for more exciting Wormpole adventures. And I think we might beat him. I don't know. I have a hunch. So why don't you go ahead and tune in in two days' time? Uh, and in, in, I don't, I won't be able to know what the, uh, fundraiser was able to raise until the next series of episodes, which is a week from today that you'll know, but here's the text on the bottom of the screen. So maybe that will be good for you to see. Um, and you can, uh, yeah, you can also donate the Black AIDS Institute, use, um, their website and everything. And it's good. It's a good thing to do. Um, so if you want to do that, you can. And thank you all for helping with the fundraiser. Steven. Steven. By the way, I broke my headphones. I don't know if you can see them on the screen there, but when I threw them off, they uh, shattered. It's easy fix, but that's funny.